Hey, what's going on guys? Sandy here and welcome back to some more Pixelmon. This is episode four, th three, four, I don't remember. <laughs> this is episode four and uh, where we left off, if you guys remember, we caught ourselves a Snorlax and a Ghastly. But uh, dudes, I got some bad news about those Pokemon. <laughs> Uh, I'll let you know. I I'll tell you about those soon. But uh, first, again, guys, the support on this series is insane. Last video has like 90,000 likes. Freaking insane. So again, keep up the support. We'll keep doing this weekly. And uh, yes, okay. So I got some bad news for you. I'll show. I'll tell you that in a little bit. First, as you can tell, I, I, I destroyed my home. <laughs> as you can see here, Craner has a modern looking house. He built that, got windows, every it's a modern, nice looking house. Back here, you have Captain Sparkles with a nice modern looking mount, side of the mountain house. And then me, I have a, I had an ugly Poké Center house. So, <laughs> we're gonna fix that. What I have over here is check this out. I have a bunch of materials here from tearing down that Poké Center. I got a crap ton of wood, a crap ton of glass. What I'm gonna do is, as you guys know, I am a horrible builder. <laughs> when it comes to building anything, I'm like a, I, I'm like a two-year-old with building blocks. <laughs> it's pretty freaking bad. So what I'm gonna do on Planet Minecraft, I found this modern looking house. I've imported it on the server and it doesn't have anything special about it. It just looks freaking sick. So it's not gonna help me advance in catching Pokemon or anything. It just allows me to have a nice looking house. So what I'm gonna do, let's do a uh, slash schematic uh, load house five there we go now it's loaded now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna do slash slash rotate 90. there we go so what i'm gonna do craner's house is there captain sparkle's house is there so i think i could put it somewhere here i guess yeah right here i guess we'll, so we'll do slash slash paste right please don't crash the server okay it's good there we go <laughs> Look at this! This is my new house! It's a modern house, and I, I know what you guys are thinking, Sunday, this is cheating, you're not building anything, but again, there's nothing in here that can help me. Yeah, it's mostly just wool, which I have over there, some some wood, which I have over there, that's pretty much it, and some chests, which I, I have a bunch of logs over there. So yeah, I don't think this is cheating. Hopefully you guys don't get too mad, and if Captain Sparkles or Craner want to do the same thing and get, spawn in a nice looking house, they can. <laughs> go ahead. So what I'm going to do to make sure all of this is somewhat legit, let's go into here. Let's bring up our delete tool. Let's delete all of this stuff just so we don't have any of it. There we go. It's all deleted. There we go. So here we go. We have our nice modern looking house. <laughs> Ah, this thing looks sick though. I have to say, let's get on our Firo. I have to say, this house looks pretty sick. I found it on Planet Minecraft. It's even got a bal. Look at this. It's got a, it's got a balcony. <laughs> I, I'm living a good life. I, I'm the new Donald Trump. Anyway, so in between episodes, I'll move all my stuff over there, make this house look even better. This house looks freaking sick. I love the modern style of houses. But anyways, okay, so what I want to do, like I said, I have some bad news for you. As you know, I caught a Snorlax, a Ghastly, and I also have a Magikarp for a guy, uh, Gyarados. But what we've done is we've added a mod into this server, and it calculates IVs and EVs. Now check what this means. As you guys know, IVs show how strong a Pokemon is uh, for either battling or PvP or anything of the above. But check this out. If I want to execute this command, what I do, type in slash IVS space and the slot the Pokemon is in that I want to test or check. So look at this. Let's do slot number four, which is the Ghastly, which is currently level 12. So if I type in four, check out this IV. 36% perfect. This Pokemon sucks. <laughs> I was so happy about this Ghastly too, but it freaking sucks. Let's do this again. IV number five. Check out my Snorlax. 39%. <laughs> 
Let's go to the next Pokemon, which is my Magikarp. Let's go to slot number six. 46%. <laughs> the only Pokemon that is relatively good is my Scyther, which is uh, 75%. <laughs> Dudes, my Pokemon suck. Let's just get down to it. My Pokemon suck. So that's what we're going to be doing this episode. I want to catch new Pokemon that don't have horrible IVs. Oh yeah, and apparently Craner, whenever I had my old house, apparently he lived under my house. <laughs> no freaking clue. Uh, okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to run around. We're going to level up our Scyther because, my, like I said, my Scyther is uh it has an iv of 75 percent, so i'm gonna keep that but what we're gonna do we're gonna run around level up my scyther uh we're gonna look for more chance cubes and we're also gonna look for uh i want to i want to test this theory out with the ivs let me go over here into the in the water where magikarps can spawn Carp. Uh, yeah, right here. So I just heard him. Yeah, Magikarp right there. Level 12 Magikarp. If I throw this Ultra Ball at it, can I catch it? Let's see. <laughs> Ultra Ball to the dome. Is it going to work? There we go. We caught the Magikarp. Okay, so let's throw down our computer, our PC, and let's swap out this Magikarp for our Charmander. Let's do the same command, IV slot number three. 55% okay, so this is true. I could possibly catch a 100% perfect Magikarp. So what I'm gonna do, let's run around. I'm gonna just throw a crap ton of Ultra Balls at, at all of these Magikarps. Let's see if we can get a near perfect Magikarp for a near perfect Gyarados. All right, Magikarp, get, get in my Ultra Ball, <laughs> Pokemon Go style. P please don't fight. D don't fight it. B oh, yeah. how did you? Get how did you? You're level nine. <laughs> please don't make me hit you in the face. There we go. <laughs> don't make me hit you in the face with my Scyther. Okay, let's go ahead. Uh, uh, put him up here. Drop down this Magikarp into slot number three, and let's re-activate uh, this command. 53. Okay. So this has an IV of 53. What I'm going to do is let's just delete all of these Magikarps that I don't want. There we go. Delete all of those. And let's just keep doing this. Let's go. Magikarp farming. One, two, and... Is, hold on. Let's see if these two work. Got one. Got to there we go. Yeah, so let's see what this IV is for slot number five 65 Okay, let's test number six 39 you freaking trash can get <laughs> Go in the trash. Okay, so we have a 65 IV Magikarp I'll hang on to that for now. Let's keep let's keep Magikarp farming. C come here Magikarp Pokemon go style do not fight your- don't- don't fight inevitability. <laughs> Here we go. I will murder your entire family. Well, both of these Magikarps suck. 42 and 47. Let's delete those. So we currently have a 65 IV Magikarp. I do- I want a strong one, because as you guys know, Gyarados is freaking sick. <laughs> we need a strong Gyarados. Oh, here's a bunch of Magikarp. Okay. Magikarp. Let's do this. Let's go back to our redneck Magikarp. fishing. <laughs> I need some dynamite. There we go. Two more. Are they going to get in the ball? One. Got one. And two. There we go. Let's do this again. IV slot five. 49. That sucks. IV slot six. 56. Dang it, we have a 65, but they are getting higher. Let's delete both of those. You know what I'm going to do for now, dudes? I'm just going to sit here and spam this for a little bit. If I could find anything better than 65, I'll let you know. Oh, is that a shiny Magikarp? That's a shiny Magikarp! Magikarp. I have to catch that! Magikarp. Please, do not fight an Evan, please! Okay, 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 I'm going to throw my Scyther at this one. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So let's throw my Scyther at this Magikarp. 
Okay, Scyther, I want you to false swipe his face hole. Yes! Do it again, Magic Card. False swipe his face. There we go. Bag, Pokeball, Ultra Ball. This is a shiny! Did we Yes! I have a shiny Pokemon! <laughs> yes! There he is! Look at that! Okay, we're gonna test his IV in a second. Let me test these other two IVs. Let's go to test our six slot. 42. Okay, that sucks. Test our five slot. 56. Okay, we'll delete both of these. I want to see what this IV of this shiny is. If we could get a good shiny Gyarados, that would be intense. Okay, here we go. Slot number five. 44%. You know what? I don't care. It's a freaking shiny. We're going to hang on to him forever. Okay, and I think over here... Hold on. No, I didn't want to throw that out. I, I saw a boss Pokemon. I thought I saw... Hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I saw a boss Pokemon somewhere. In the water. Maybe he despawned. That's fine. We we caught ourselves a shiny. Oh, here we go. Another 65%. Uh, slot number five. Okay, let's hang on to him. So we have two 65%ers right now. Let's delete this other one. Okay. I have six Ultra Balls left. I'm starting to run low on Ultra Balls. That's fine. I could go make a crap ton more. What is it? A Nato Queen. Okay. Let's see what these are. Well, there we go. I've used all of my Ultra Balls and I have two 65 percenters. I don't know. I mean, can they get any better than that? I mean, you, th you would think so. I'm not sure. Let's go back home. I'm going to make some more Ultra Balls. And then we're going to head back to uh, to that one biome. I want to catch a better Ghastly. All right, there we go. So we have 28 more Ultra Balls. Uh, okay, I think we're good to go. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head back in this direction. Again, while I'm doing that, what I'm going to do is like this Electabuzz. I'm going to throw my, uh, my Scyther at it. Swap out to my Fero, and then one-shot this Electabuzz, Fero. maybe. Aerial Ace. Uh, oh, good. <laughs> Electric versus Air, not a good idea. Snorlax, please. Murder his face, lick him to death. Anyway, so, so that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to look for Pokemon to, to power level my Scyther. Like this little drowsy. I'll just take out the little guys. Uh, okay, he wants to fight me. <laughs> Let's go to Pokemon. Uh, Fero, Let's go ahead and one-shot this guy. Uh, aerial ace get, get wrecked there, there we go so we got 215 experience on our scyther oh actually you know what i just thought about if one of these mill the mill tanks if i could get a mill tank with one of one ability that i'm looking for mill tanks can be op so what i'm gonna do let's throw uh our scyther at this mill tank right here level six Let's false swipe him in the dome. There you go. Are you at one hit point? Let's false swipe again. Okay, at one hit point. Let's toss a ultra ball at your fate. Please don't fight fate. But please don't fight fate, Miltank. Join my team. Uh, team, I don't know yet. I think this Thursday. There we go. This Thursday, we're going to have an event or a competition between us three to figure out who's going to join what team. Okay, here we go. Uh, okay, Miltank, let's do, let's do IV slot number six. This Miltank is 31%. <laughs> you are a waste. Get deleted. Good lord. Let's catch another one. Okay, there we go. I finally caught a Miltank. Oh, good lord. Okay. Uh, let's get out our PC. Uh, oh, yeah, it's right there. Okay, let me check the, uh, let me check the, uh, IV of this. IV 6. 58%. That kind of sucks, but I'm seeing a theme here. I'm not really, I mean, our Scyther is 75%. I don't, is there a way to get the IVs higher in Pixelmon? I'm not really sure. Oh, there's a, a Graveler. Yes, I want a Graveler to get it in, to turn it into a Golem. Yeah, 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 hold on. Is this an invisible poker chest? <laughs> Let's see what's in here. What is it? At what? Sun, oh, a Sunstone. Nice, that's for evolutions. Okay. 
So, like I said, what I'm going to do, I want to look for a Graveler. And again, what I'm looking for is high IVs. This mill tank is level 7, and it has an IV of over 50. And once it hits, I believe, level 11, it'll learn the attack or the ability that I'm looking for. So let's do that and look for a Graveler that we can capture. Another Poke Chest and also a Chance Cube. Oh, <laughs> this is good. Let's open this. Uh, what? Seismic to- Oh, this is an ability. Nice. Okay, so we have that. Oh, two Chance Cubes. <laughs> Perfect. Remember, we have this Tier 4 Chance Pendant. Let's see what we get from this. Something good. <laughs> Another generator. That is awesome for more power. Hold on. Let's go over there. Let's get this other chance cube. Let's throw out our Firo. Here we go. Let's go grab this other chance cube. This better be something good. What is it? A, a golden bag of holding. <laughs> We have a mobile double chest. Okay. So what I'm going to do now, I want to level up our mill tank really quick to level 11. Uh, what it, a fly gun. Oh, good lord. Level 48. Nope, can't take down that fly gun. Let's look for something else. A level 39 vibrava. Okay, let's throw out our uh, mill tank. I missed. <laughs> throw out our mill, mill tank. Uh, wait, wait, why do you keep missing right there? Vibrava, fight me. Fight me like a... There we go. Okay, and then we'll send out our Scyther to also get experience. That's fine. It took a little bit of damage. And then let's throw out our Fero to finish the job. Aerial Ace. There we go. Half of its health gone. Aerial Ace again. There we go. And one more shot for the, for the kill. Okay. Mill Tank learned Stomp. Okay, level 8, level 9, level 10, level 24. Okay, so mill tank learn stop. One more level on our mill tank and it'll have the ability that I want it to have. Uh, I guess let's take down this Doug Trio really quick. There we go. Let's send out our Scyther to also get experience. And then our Snorlax to finish the job. Come on, Snorri. <laughs> let's do this. Let's use Lick. Let's lick him to death. One more lick left, Snorlax. <laughs> there we go. Did my mill tank level up? Mill tank level 11, 12, and here it is. This ability is called Milk Drink. What this does is whenever you use it in battle, it heals half of your maximum HP. And as you guys saw in last challenge versus Craner, any heal ability is O. P as crap. So now we have a Snorlax that can heal himself. And we also have a Mill Tank that can heal himself. <laughs> this is gonna be good. But yeah, dudes, for now, I'm gonna end this video. If you guys are still enjoying this series, of course, keep up the support. Hit that like button down below, and uh, we'll continue this series. And uh, yes, what I'm gonna do now, I'm heading in this direction. I want to find another Snorlax and Ghastly that doesn't suck. <laughs> okay, we'll see you dudes next time. Oh, a chance cube. Wait. You know we gotta do it. What is it?